Right, hello. It is Christmas Day 2021. Santa has been. And I got lucky and got a load of palm seeds for for Christmas. So we'll have a quick look through, see what we've got. And I'll uh, we'll get these on the go as soon as possible. So let's have a quick look at the... Uh, Types we've got here, so we've got a sable there. Um, got four types. So that's picking up very well on camera. Sable Carciarum. So we, we've got some to try there. Bermudiana. Some. Uh, Looking fresher than others. So, for instance, the Cassiarum look nice and shiny and clean and fresh. Some are uh, a little bit sort of, uh, I don't know, maybe older and powdery, but we're going to give these a good soak. Smaller ones probably soak for two or three days in warm water, while the bigger ones maybe up to five or six days. So, what else we got? Uh, Livingstone of Chinensis, they're quite nice big seeds. We've got some random stuff here, which I mean, I, I asked for these. I did make a list on eBay for the the wife to uh, do for me. So uh, some are just uh, we've got spindle palm there. Some we're going to try. I mean, I don't necessarily hold up much hope for a lot of them, but well, it's always worth a try. They weren't overly expensive. Florida thatch palm. Yeah, we've got another dipsis one there. So we're going to give these a try. Not all palm seeds. We have got some uh, grasses as well. That one is, says uh, Panama hat plant, often confused with a palm tree. So it looks quite like a palm tree, but it's actually grass. But um, we'll give that a go. So a few tiny little seeds on there. And we've got the uh, palm grass there. I don't know if anyone's tried that before. That's, uh, it is a grass, but it looks like the strap leaves of a palm. They look quite nice. So again, if anyone's tried any of these and had success, let me know. We've got some uh, banana here as well, Musa. So that is like the pink flower and banana there. And we've got this one, which I was quite intrigued with. A hairy banana, so apparently the bananas are actually hairy, as, as it might suggest there. Um, so yeah, we'll certainly give them a try. I think that's a fairly dwarf species. So yeah, I think it's always worth a go trying something different. And then we've just got some capulta there, which uh, sometimes called um, what Indian bean tree or something like that. Which is like a large leaf. Fairly fast growing tree, so we'll give them a go as well. So yeah, we've got some things to try there with the bananas. I'll, I'll boil the kettle and wax some boiling hot water on them for about 20 seconds to put some microfractures in the seed because the bananas are notoriously hard seed. So if you can get some microfractures in there, then soak them for in. Like I say, boiling hot water for maybe 20 seconds and then you literally just lukewarm water for a couple of days. Then I'll stick them in a pot and they'll want 25 to 30 degrees during the day and probably 15 at night. So you want that night time drop. So that is, I'll probably put them in my uh, indoor palm tent which does have uh, about 26 during a day and drops down about 
16 at night, so that should be okay for them. But like I say, the rest of the palms will need a good soaking for a while. But yeah, so there's uh, a few things to try there. So I'm looking forward to that. I hope uh, everyone's having a good Christmas. Thanks for watching. We'll catch you on the next one.